G'day fellas and welcome back to the Dreadnoughts franchise. What a shocker. Dreadnoughts are back in the playoffs and it's time for us to dominate again. This time, hopefully we don't get dominated in the Super Bowl though, if we make it. Last episode was interesting. I will say that a lot of people were shocked by the Pat Whittle debut. A lot of people like the idea of Pat Whittle becoming maybe the number one player, the number one quarterback on the squad. There was also a lot of people that said they want Marcus Elliott. So I'm in a tough situation right now. <laughs> I'm always pulling for the underdog. The one thing that Pat Whittle is better than Mario at is that throw on the run. And what we saw in that game against the Jets was pure domination when it came to throwing it on the run. He took full advantage of his opportunity as the starter here in San Antonio. Now, obviously, Mario is the better quarterback. Ranked ninth overall in the NFL. And uh, it would be stupid to not start Mario in the playoffs. However... If he starts playing like crap and missing simple passes, then I'm bringing in Pat Whittle. You know, that's the best I can do. But in this episode, I need you to let me know, are we committed to Marcus Elliott, okay? If we are, I will go out of my way to draft him and bring him to the team. Pat Whittle's good, but I think Marcus Elliott will be better. We got a game to worry about. Why worry about next season when we're in the current season, all right? I spoke to Gino earlier. It doesn't sound like he's coming back. Oh, okay. I see what's going on here. A veteran has Super Bowl aspirations. I know. I just spoke to Darius Leonard like five seconds ago. We have the Patriots. Oh, this is going to be a game, man. We versed them earlier in the season. And if you didn't know, the Patriots have Mario Gutierrez's former college teammate at San Diego State University. Getting a quick look, they have Harold Landry. Didn't know that. They have Stefan Gilmore, David Andrews, etc. They got Tyler Eifert, Zach McCauley. This is dude I was talking about, uh, Mario's former teammate. He's up to an 85 himself. So Chiefs beat the Browns. Uh, Dallas beat Philly. So that means the Cowboys are in the postseason. Hopefully we don't meet him in the Super Bowl again. New England smashed the Steelers and Atlanta beating Tampa Bay in overtime. Seahawks Cowboys gonna be a big game. I'm really pulling for the Hawks in that one. Let me know down in the comment section as well who you reckon's gonna win. I don't know about all these games, but I'm feeling the dreadnoughts. I reckon they can pull this off. Man, 4,000 legacy score. I think it's locked in that Dupree has won. Uh, I can't confirm that, however, so still going to try and, you know, play well with Dupree. But with that being said, fellas, if you are new around here and you enjoy Madden and NCAA 14 content, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to sub. All of my social medias are down in the didgeridoo. If you drop me a follow, it would be much appreciated, man. And with that being said, fellas, let's jump into it. Man, Nikhil Harry's still rocking number one. That's crazy, bro. Man, if I was in those stands right now, I'd be buying five beers just to chuck them at the Patriots players as they walked out. You can't do that, though. You get kicked out, won't you? Yeah. What, has he got a Denny's menu? What, what is that, coach? What are you hiding there? So I don't think the Texans made it this year to the playoffs. There's only two Texas teams left. I want to be the Texas team that gets that Super Bowl, but last year we gave it to Dallas. Oh, what do you got, Pat McCauley? Wow. Oh my, the first play of the game. Come on, ref. That is a BS call. Unnecessary roughness. This is the playoffs. Man, the Patriots are out for blood. I think we beat them earlier in the season, so. They want that revenge. That's a pick. Let's go, man. Tyson Bowie on the user alert. Gonna take it back 80 yards, man. Celebrate on them, boys. Let's go, man. Already in the zone to start the game. On a simple blitz, we got the pick. All right, where do we want to go here? Third and six. I'm just going to stick on the outside. What about unnecessary roughness for me trainer there, mate? You just ran into him. Come on now. All right, second and long. Coaches call. I like this play. This looks kind of cheesy, honestly. There's no way you can stay with Matt Moore. Do you know he has in out elite? Come on now. Get them blocks on the outside though. Ah, oh, he broke it. He broke it. They are shutting down Dupree today. I, well, I didn't mean to do it, but we get a first down out of it. Ebron out there. Interesting. Ebron. Here we go, Ebron. Truck him. Ooh. He wants that number one spot on the depth charts. 
So far on the game, Dupree has 20 yards of five carries. Not, not having the best game today. That's okay. I feel like they're going to target him, if anything. This might be a good opportunity for our receiving core as a whole to kind of... Everybody's tired, bro. Come on. Taking off with Mario. Okay. I didn't realize. I thought he was faster than that. Isn't he faster than that? Got him. Let's go, Johnny Ross in the end zone. We go up 14-0 like it's nothing. Kind of embarrassing. I want to show you guys more defense, but it's it's Zach McCauley throwing the play away three times in a row and then running it for three. Come on, mate. We got this. Oh, 66. Kevin Zyla. What a block that was, mate. The goal was to block your running back. You did a great job there. I don't like this play, but you know what? Coach caught it, so I'll rock with it. Take it off. Let's go, Mario. Mario with the juke! That's what I'm talking about, man. On third and 16, he takes off. Jukes the defender. This is so much fun now. Cut it out. Peter Curry, the pro bowler, gets the block. Dupree does the rest. That's another massive play. Maybe Dupree can block on the outside. He's gone. Throw it up to him. Oh! I thought he snagged it with the fatal. He looked like Kobe Bryant out there. Coach, I'm not joking, bro. I need some better plays. These plays that we got called right now, they ain't it. These are not the plays. Let's try this. Uh-oh. He script. I didn't even do that. That was the play action. We got to take a 50-yarder Terry Marta field goal. <laughs> oh, bro. I'm calling a timeout. Timeout! I can't... I can't even call a timeout. You've got to be kidding me. Now I call a timeout. That is the biggest slap in the face with a big dong that I've ever seen. Imagine. Come on, Madden. Okay, Derrick Henry with a nice little run. Peppers, come down a little bit. You're too far back. We're in the backfield! Jabril and Darius Leonard. Go ahead, send Darius on the blitz. Where's Keon? Is Keon out here? Uh-oh. I think I'm on Gino. <laughs> no! Oh, as if we gave that up. Still have that X Factor popped on Bowie. Late into the second quarter. That just goes to show that they haven't been making any yards whatsoever. He's gonna get sacked. Gino Atkins in his final season. Man, what a big boy play that was to shut him down. Oh, man. Oh, wow. Okay, when they want to get to Dupree, they will. That's confirmed. Drop him back. Over the top. Oh! Oh, what a date! And there's no way that just happened. Come on, please. No! That would have... <laughs> what? Bro, that counted. That is sickening that that counted. I feel so bad for the Patriots right now. I actually saw Eric Rayweather tweet something like that the other day. And I thought, ah, you know, probably really rare scenario that happens. But no, nah, that's... He won lion, man. That stuff does happen. There's nobody on the right. I think that was a no-brainer. I mean, if you're not going to defend the MVP, of course I'm going to go to him. Looks like we're going to have an interesting matchup if we come away with the dub in this. Jacksonville in the AFC Championship. I'm taking this out, by the way. We ain't scared. Juke! Ah. Get it, baby. I see you, Matt. Wide open! That's a big boy first down. Mario has been very, very consistent today. Other than the obvious incompletions on the team. He's played really good. No bad throws, nothing. There we go, Matt Moore again. Got it with the juke. That's two plays we nearly go on the whole field. You know what I really want? To be able to take off with Mario again. If we get good blocking or they don't send much pressure, I'm going to go for it. Taking off, here we go. Let's go, Mario. 
Why does he run so slow initially? Johnny Ross on a drag. Is that our game plan? I think this was a pre-drawn up play. We knew where we're going. To Mario! Let's go, first down. All right, this is a strange one from Coach. I want to go to Matt Moore. Let's throw it up to Matt Moore, see what happens. Okay. Dupree, I thought you were meant to try and block Ogba. Okay. Oh, that's a mean blitz. <laughs> if I had an extra half second there, that would have been straight down the middle bit. We're going to have to punt it away as well. All right, here we go. This is a tough one right here. This is a tough one. By my calculations, that's a good kick. Oh, that was a shocker, mate. All right, Bowie still has his X Factor. I just want to point that out. We've had it pretty much since the beginning of the first quarter. Beginning of the game. And this is exactly why. They just keep running the ball. They're down 21-0. And their game plan is to just run it down the gut. A again and again and again. Here we go. One-on-one -on -one with Josh Gordon. I need William Jackson to step up on the kill Harry. Oh. No way. <laughs> That's another fourth down. Go ahead, finish them right here. It's been on 21-0 for a while. Oh my goodness, look at the blocks. Auden Tate doing his best impersonation of a lineman. Let's try this again. Dupree's tired, so let's hope uh, Mr. Linebacker bites. He does. Get that block. Look at Mario scrambling. I should have slid, but Mario, he doesn't, he's not a bitch. So this is apparently part of our game plan. I don't know how our game plan is to lose yards, but... Oh crap, we had square wide open. They don't look like they have many people on the left, so the play action... We should be fine on the play action. There we go, look at this! Get the block! Oh man, Peter Curry, do your job. That's third and goal. Rodney Anderson checking in. Oh, I didn't... You know what? That's fine. We waste a lot of time right there. I'm surprised we haven't scored all second half. Like, it, they've shut us down. Granted, I've been calling coach plays. But still, five minutes left. This is what the playoffs are all about. Fourth and three. Finally, they understand the urgency. They're going to pass it. I think that knocks... Yeah, Tyson Bowie comes out of his X-Factor form. Uh, don't... <laughs> The middle of the field is... No, I didn't want to call that. Oh! Man, okay. Trust me, you don't want this blitz. Screenplay. Oh, no. <laughs> no! We let him in! We gave that crappy quarterback they had a touchdown. Oh, well, I don't, I don't even care. I'm just going to... They go off... I don't know what this play is. This is what coach called. This is fine. I'll jump on Bowie. Nah, man, I can't defend three people. What a silly call. Third and six. I want the first down. Actually, can I change this up? Let's go. Let's change it up. Oh, I thought they were going to send a blitz. Matt Moore! No! Mario doesn't have the throw on the run. I felt like Pat Whittle would have probably made that pass. Here we go, there. By my calculations, I think I might have hit that a bit too hard. Oh, no! No! Thank you very much. Pin him back on the three. Crow, he does it again. They're going five wide. They're going to have to pass these really fast. Because the blitz is coming. Oh, fumble! Get on it! No! It's going to be a safety, bro. Who hit him? Somebody just smacked McCoy. It was Darius Leonard. When there's a big play or a big fumble, it's always Darius Leonard. Always. They're not even going to call timeouts. I think they know. It's a wrap. They already know. They don't even want to play anymore. And good on them. Why waste time when you know that we've won the game? Get that block. No disrespect, but I'm going to try and score a late touchdown. Yeah, there you go. Oh, there's a flag. Of course there would be a flag. How is that not in unnecessary roughness as well? There's eight seconds left. You know what we have to do? Here we go, fine. You want to do this? We'll do it. Come on. 
Right there. That's perfect. That's perfect right there. Oh! He's done it again! Pins him back on the 16. Is it? Pick. Tyson Bowie. Oh, he broke it! No! What a play to end the game. Bowie with his second pick. He, he got a pick on like the third play and then the very last play. That's crazy. Checking out the stats on the day. Mario with a 131.5 passer rating. Completion rate a little bit down. I don't know, man. I tried to scramble a bit. I think we did well in the scrambling department, but most important thing is we destroyed former college teammate Zach McCauley. Rushing in 94 yards for Dupree. That's all right. He took it easy today. One touchdown. Mario with a 9.4 average though. Receiving end, pretty well distributed, I would say again. The one passing touchdown going to Jay Ross. And then on the defensive end, what can I say? Tyson Bowie, 93 interception return yards. The TFLs were nice. We got some sacks in there. You know what was crazy, bud? Hold on. How did I forget about the Auden Tate reception? When it bounced off Matt Moore's hands, he caught it and ran off. That was the most crazy play I have ever seen. <laughs> With that being said, fellas, if you made it this far into the video, you are the real MVP. Hope the rest of your day is awesome. And from me personally, I'm out. Peace.